Do you want to connect your AirPods to laptop? Then you are at the right place. We have got the easy way to do that. Welcome back to Silicophilic, your go-to source for tech tips and fixes. Connect AirPods to Laptop Here is how to connect your AirPods to a Windows laptop. Before you connect the AirPods to your laptop, first make sure that the Bluetooth is available on your Windows device. For that, go to the system tray and look for the Bluetooth icon. If it is there, then this means your laptop has Bluetooth available. If your laptop doesn't have Bluetooth available, then you need a Bluetooth dongle and plug it into the laptop. To begin with, put the AirPods into their charging case. Close the case and wait a few seconds. Make sure the AirPods are charged before you pair them to the laptop. Now, open the AirPods case and leave the AirPods inside while you follow the rest of these steps. Press and hold the setup button. It is the small circular button on the back side of the case. So, look for it and hold it down until you see the LED lights flashing. For the AirPods users with the Generation 1 case, the light will flash inside the case. For Generation 2 AirPods or AirPod Pros, you will find the light on the front side. The setup button puts the AirPods into pairing mode. So, don't skip this step as it is essential for pairing any Bluetooth device. Now, on your Windows laptop, press Windows plus I to open the Settings menu. Select Bluetooth and Devices in the left-hand column. Turn on the toggle for Bluetooth. Next, click on the Add Device button. From the pop-up screen, choose Bluetooth. After a few seconds, you will see a list of available Bluetooth devices loading on this Add a Device window. Click the icon for your AirPods. Now, Windows will display a message that you have successfully connected the AirPods to the Windows laptop. And there you have it, the method to connect AirPods to the laptop. We hope the method has worked for you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and troubleshooting guides. Leave a comment and help others know about the method. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.